Hi guys, this is PlayerFan666, and today I'm going to show you how to mod Fallout New Vegas for the Xbox 360 using a USB. Alright, so first what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to save the game save that you want to mod, and save it onto your USB from your Xbox console. Alright, once you do that, you're going to need a couple of programs in order to mod this uh, Fallout New Vegas or you're going to need this program which you will use to extract the game save onto your desktop. You're going to need the actual Fallout modding program which I will have in the description. It's really easy. It's a mega upload. And it's very simple. Alright, you're going to need Modio. This is very important as well. Alright, All right, so you're going to plug your USB into your computer, computer and you're going to file open drive. Double click here. And there's your game save. Alright. So, you're going to click and drag it onto your desktop, but I'm not going to, considering that I have already modded this, alright? So, I'm going to use a different game save. Alright, I suggest you make a folder, just in case if um, USB crashes or whatever. If you have the new Xbox, uh, Xbox Slim, I have that. It will not crash the USB, but on my old Xbox it has happened to me, so make sure you make a folder like this one over here. Alright guys, alright, once you have extracted onto your desktop, you're going to open up the Fallout modding program, which I said I will have in the description. Click open. Make sure you have extracted it onto your desktop and nowhere else. Double click it. It will load up and it will show everything that you have, your playtime. This is very similar if you've seen my other video on how to mod Fallout 3. This is basically the exact same modding program. Alright. So, but um, for that modding program that I had, when you max the special stats out, it didn't really work. For this one it does. Alright, the only bad thing about this program that gets really confusing are these things that say unknown here. You can see, unknown. It's just all the brand new weapons that they've added from Fallout, um, like the new weapons from Fallout New Vegas. They have not been um, put in with this program, so they will say unknown. So you have to be really careful and know what you're doing with what you're adding to this, right? And like I said too, you can change the quantity of this by double clicking this and um, erasing this and by putting in a uh, certain amount of how much you want and um, you can also do the condition of a weapon so it does way more damage. Alright, this is a very handy tool. It does not crash. I've not had any crashes. Alright, once you're done that, you're going to save it. After you're done saving it, you're going to exit out. This is where Modio, you must have Modio to do this. You're then going to have to drag the game save into Modio. Alright, it will show this. You're going to have to push Rehash and Resign or it will not work once you plug into your Xbox. Alright, once you click that, just exit out. Alright, then you're going to open up the USB. You're going to delete this. You're going to delete the current game save that is not modded, and you're going to drag this game save in. Alright, and then you're all set to go to mod. Alright, guys, but um, one last thing that um, you're going to need for this program is um, the link which I will give you to download. It will come with these, which show you, if you've seen my last video, you should look it up. It's how to mod Fallout 3. Uh, there's a search engine for the modding program, which you just type in what weapon you want, and it will pop up, and it will give you the code, which you will place inside the modding program to change weapons. But for some reason, this pro modding program does not have any. So this is everything in the game that you could possibly have. Alright guys, and it will come with this, so whatever you can look through it, whatever you want, just copy this and put it into the um, form ID, and it will work, right? Make sure you don't forget while you're doing this to push update, or it will not work, and it's really important you save it as well. Alright, thanks for watching guys, I really appreciate it. See you later, bye.